John is just not as fast and not as quick and he doesn't react as well as Ed does and that but he still is able to keep his cool. And I was surprised he didn't get taken Higher down. Attention, please. Higher attention, please. Dr. Timothy Thompson. Dr. Timothy 137 Thompson. remains. So number five is the South VA Bannock appears to be tiring. In fact, both men appear to be tiring in the final moment. For she skips away. Head wasn't quite intensive enough and didn't control that leg quite as well as he could have. Oh. So he's trying to feel back up there. No, 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 no. no. He's stalling. He's stalling. He's stalling. He's stalling. He's taking half shots. He's the only one going underneath. You heard the stalling warning there. We have one minute and five seconds left. Bob, it's tough to wrestle a guy like that because he just keeps pressure, constant, constant, constant pressure on him. Forshee tries to shoot. Bannock counters. Almost turned him over. Bannock has him where he wants it now. He gets the two-point takedown. He can't get him on his back. He lets Forshee up for the escape nine to four now john doesn't want him when he hits in there he doesn't want him to come up and get that body press again and that's what he's trying to hold him back on bannock trying to get the other take down and gets it 11 to four and if he can hold on he'll have the superior decision because he's well up in riding time to not allow Forshee to escape in the final 11 tired. seconds I'm sorry, Bob. John, I was just going to say, John seems to be a little tired, a little. But he's, he, you know, you're going to get tired when you get pressured like you do with uh, a guy like Bannock. 11 seconds to go. If Bannock holds on, he'll have a superior decision. So, Forshee will want to work for the escape. Six seconds left. 